Hey guys, I'm Ajin Des, back with another Japanese lesson, beginner Japanese lesson. Lesson 9, we're talking about age this time. So of course you're going to need to be up on your numbers. Here's 1 through 10. Make sure you know these as well as higher numbers. Today's key sentence. Watashi wa 21 sai desu. Watashi wa 21 sai desu. We got quite a few uh, new words for y'all. Um, some of them are family related words and this isn't a family a lesson about family uh, and kinship terms uh, it's just about age but I threw these in here because I thought it would be you know good uh, exposure as well as we could talk about age a little more deeply so the first one is otousa or just tousa uh, next is okasa or kasa father and mother those are respected then grandpa and grandma are ojisa or just jisa and then obasa or just basa now you'll notice i have o in kako parentheses here which means it's optional in certain situations if you're talking about other people's family members uh kare no otousa for example kanojo no obasa for example, you have to add o because it makes it polite. If you're talking about your own family members, watashi no kasa, you need to leave off the o because you don't you humble yourself in in Japanese society, you humble yourself. You don't honor yourself, so you get rid of the o. And if you just say kasa wa kasa ga nanane whatever, uh, people know automatically you're talking about your own family member because you left off the o. Enough about that. Next, uh, years old. Sai. Sai. Now there are two kanji characters for that, and I will talk a little bit more about that in this lesson later. Next is child, kodomo, kodomo, baby, akacha. Akacha. I like that word. That person over there, kind of far away. Ano hito. Ano hito. Just the word person is hito. And then two phrases. How old do I look? Nansai ni miemasu ka? Nansai ni miemasu ka? You look blank years old. Nani nani sai ni miemasu. Nani nani sai ni miemasu. Hai. Grammar. Asking uh, and stating one's age. All you do is a number and sai. It's very easy. A sai. A years old. For example, 私は13歳です。私は13歳です。I am 13 years old. あの人は52歳です。That man over there or that person over there is 52 years old. Somehow you know that he's he or she is 52 years old. Now there are two kanji characters, two Japanese uh, characters uh, for this word, sai. Originally, it was this more complicated character. Um, but that was kind of hard for people to write, or they just found it kind of uh, mendok site troubling to write, so they created this more simplified version. You are totally welcome to write this version. Usually, I see this more complicated original version on forms and official documents, things like that. Uh, and then this one, people usually just write because it's so much easier, just three characters. All right, of course, there are some exceptions when it comes to the numbers. Um, here's 1 through 10 years old. I'm just going to go down the line. Issai. Not Ichisai, but Issai. Nisai, Sansai, Yonsai, Gosai, Rokusai, Nanasai. Nanasai. Hassai. Not Hachisai, but Hassai. Kyusai and Jusai. Jusai. Now, the textbook that I'm kind of loosely basing my order off of also listed jisai as a pronunciation for 10 years old, but I've never actually heard or used that pronunciation. So let's just, I'm going to stick with jisai. Jisai. And then a little warning over here. Uh, the age 20 is kind of special. It has ma, two pronunciations. Uh, hatachi, hatachi. And, well, you could just say the traditional nijusai, nijusai, okay? I was taught uh, 
in one textbook, this author said that you must always say hatachi, never nijusai. But when I lived and, and went to Japan,、um, people said nijusai left and right. Like, I actually never heard people say hatachi.、Um, and maybe that was because they thought I didn't know hatachi, but when I mentioned hatachi, they said, ah,、oh, so, so, so. Yeah, that one. So everyone knows hatachi, and you're fine if you say hatachi des. It's not hatachi sai, but hatachi des. Am 20 years old. Okay. So now we're going to talk about asking about people's ages. You just add the word for what or nani to sai, as shown here. A wa nan sai desu ka? A wa nan sai desu ka? How old is A? Brian wa nan sai desu ka? How old is Brian?、Ah, the reply would be 36 sai desu. 36 sai desu. He's 36. Our first activity, as of January 1st, 2018, how old are the following people? Say your answer in Japanese. Go ahead and try this on your own. Pause the video, take your time. I'm gonna solve it right now. First, we have number one, Jackie. Jackie. So, this word right here is Tanjobi. And、uh, you don't have to know this. You don't have to know these characters here either. Not yet, at least.、Um, this means birthday, basically. And then. Of course, you can infer that this is the year that Jackie was born. And then remember that in Japanese, the Japanese mind, everything goes from broad to specific, okay? Big to little. So、uh, the year would be the broadest category. Next would be what? The month. And then the day. So year, month, day. Always in Japanese. That's how they. Organize their calendars, dates and times, all that stuff. So she was born 1995,、uh, April, January, February, March, April, yeah, April 13th, 413. Now, <laughs> I didn't want to take so much time in this video calculating all their ages, so I wrote all their ages down and I'm just going to state them for you. If you calculate this,、um, 20, she would be 22. Niju ni sai desu. Jackie wa niju ni sai desu. Okay? Number two, Austin. Austin, Austin, born in 1990, June 3rd, 603. Okay, that is 27 years ago from our, our set date. So he is 27 sai. 27 sai desu. Hi. Sanban, number three. Keira, Keira, Keira. Born 1978, January 9th, the first month, ninth day.、Uh, that is. Is 40 years ago. She doesn't look 40. <laughs> so that would be 40 sai desu. 40 sai desu. Okay, Yonba. Number four, Craig. Craig. He was born 1984, December 24th, Christmas Eve. Wow. So if you calculate that, that is 34 years old from the state that we have. So he is 34 sai desu. 34 sai desu. Goba, number five, Joe. Joe. He was born 1979, seventh month, 30th day. And if you calculate that, Joe is 39 years old. Sanju, Kyusai. Sanju, Kyusai desu. Hai. Rokuban, number six, Roji. Roji. Roji was born 1958, January 8th. Very close to Keila.、Uh, if you calculate this, Roji. Is 60, I believe. Yeah, 60 years old. I probably have some of these dates, some of these ages wrong, but、um, if I do, please let me know in the comments section below. And here are the answers in bold. All right, moving on. You can use this phrase, Nansai ni m i e m a s u ka, to ask for someone to guess your age. It literally means, Nansai, what age? Ni m i e m a s u ka? Do I look? What age do I look? Or how old do I look? Would be a more natural translation. The appropriate answer is number sai ni m i e m a s u Nani nani sai ni m i e m a s u Okay? For example, na sai ni m i e m a s u ka? How old do I look? San ju rok sai ni m i e m a s u You look 36. Activity two, we're going to use the same phrase.、Uh, we've got Various family members and different kinds of people here. We're going to utilize that 
extra family vocabulary that you learned in the beginning. Number one, oh, pause the video right now, try it on your own. Uh, if you want to do it, I'm going to solve right now. Number one, she's asking, Kare wa watashi no jiisan desu. Nansai ni miemasu ka? So this, per, this guy, he is, Kare wa watashi no jiisan desu. So it's my grandfather, grandpa. Nansai ni miemasu ka? How old does he look? Well, <laughs> Uh, I also wrote my sample answers down. I'm just going to say this guy looks about 60. 60, I think, would be appropriate. ni He looks about 60. Number two, she says, Kanojo wa watashi no kaasan desu. Watashi no kaasan desu. Nansai ni miemasu ka? Nansai ni miemasu ka? Uh, so she is, kanojo wa watashi no kaasan desu. She is my mother. And notice with all of these, one, two, and three, you'll notice I don't have the o, because they're talking about their own family member. Being humble, right? Nansai ni miemasu ka? How old does she look? Um, I think I wrote down 40. Yonjusai desu. Yonjusai desu. Ah, ni miemasu. Right? Because we're answering the question, how old does she look? Number three, samba. And I wrote 45. He looks about 45. So I would say, 45。そう、I Number five. How old does the child look? Kodomo ne? Kodomo. Six? Six. Rokusai. Rokusai. Ni miemasu. And here are the answers in bold, or at least the sample answers. You could have very well picked other ages other logical ages. As long as you, you know, use sai ni miyamas, you're fine. We're ending up the lesson. It was rather uh, quick this time around. I'm going to state two compositions twice. I want you to listen and write down what you hear, whether on a piece of paper or in your mind. Pause the video if you need any time. I'm going to start. Number one, watashi no tousan wa 51歳です。私の父さんは51歳です。The answer is 私の父さんは51歳です。Okay. Number 2 あの人は19歳に見えます。あの人は19歳に見えます。The answer is, You'll notice I used the simpler kanji for sai. You know, so you wouldn't, if you're writing kanji in these lessons, you wouldn't have to write that super hard one. If you did, that's fine. Activity four, translation practice. Translate the following statements into either English or Japanese. Go ahead, pause the video. Try it on your own. I'm going to solve it right now. Jeshi no Okasanwa yonju yon sai des. Jessi, Jessi, right? Jessi no okasan wa yonju yon sai des. So Jessi's, this is the possessive, right? Like apostrophe s. Jessi's okasan mom wa is yonju yon sai des is 44. Jessi's mom is 44 years old. Why this person knows that, I don't know. And then that person looks 28 years old. Well, that person we learned at the beginning is ano hito. Ano hito wa 28 years old, 28歳 ni miemasu. Okay. Back to our key sentence. Watashi wa 21歳 desu. So now you should know that this means I am 21 years old. Okay. Homework. How old are you? Please tell me, if you feel comfortable, please tell me how old you are in the comment section below. 
uh, just write it in Japanese. Okay, and then of course there's a worksheet that accompanies this lesson. Uh, you can go to my website; it's there for free to download, as well as a uh, answer sheet that goes along with it. All the links will be in the description. And that's about it. I hope you guys learned a lot. As always, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below for me. I'll get I'll try to answer them as soon as I can. Thank you guys for continuing to watch these videos. I hope you learned a lot. See you in the next lecture.